What's up LP Nation? It's your guy LP again. For today's growth series I have something quick but sweet and awesome. I wanted to show you clickable signature feature. So clickable signature feature for email. I'm going to use Gmail as an example but you can really copy paste this signature which I'm going to create for you now and show you how to create it. You can paste this signature in most other emails so i tested it in outlook so i would use this for my laptop and for my pc or mac okay uh, so let's try it out as you can see on this screen recording now i have like my test email and you can see like test email for signature you see my signature it's basically a simple subscribe button yeah i am uh, all around like advertising my new youtube channel i have to do it basically everyone who receives my mail email gets this like signature so yeah every traffic driven to my youtube channel is a good traffic so i advise you to do something similar for your or job or small business anything you advertise it's great to have something very important in your email signature imagine all the people you email they will receive this so let's get into it let's click my signature when you click my signature you get like exactly this you get my channel so this is awesome imagine like putting a clickable signature for your company or something so let's dive into it directly so ladies and gentlemen the first step would be to find an image you want to use as your clickable signature that that's obvious but let's presume you have found your image first you will need to upload the image on some image hosting server something like as i use postimage.org uh, that's free image hosting uh, this is not an affiliate link uh, don't worry um, so you can post your images here with no expiration uh, a lot of services use this so I use it it's really good let us go to it uh, step one I will later like zoom in for you to see but let's choose our image so you're on postimages.org or any other basically server you don't have to use this uh, hosting service if you don't but choose image upload your image i uh, selected my lp studio logo then you will have a direct link you will copy this direct link in your clipboard then you will go to your gmail inbox you will select let's zoom it out zoom it in sorry let's zoom it in a bit so you see okay settings scroll down signature so you have to obviously select this now insert image choose web address now paste the link you got voila here's the logo select okay we will zoom out so you can see okay this logo is obviously too big so we will double click and we will select this is large okay small is too small medium stick it to this size around this size so medium works for me now when you have the image like it has the cursor has to blink here hold left click and drag it until the image is like blue like this now click link again here is your main web address so when someone clicks your signature it will lead to that web address it can be your blog your company i don't know your personal site doesn't matter for me it's my uh, like portfolio site it will be lparats.com so lparac.com okay and you will you will press okay now uh, 
I will click insert this signature before quote to text and replies and remove the, the, that line that preceded. So basically, uh, what it uh, makes, it makes that your signature is above that, that uh, stupid line that like cuts it off. So check this box and click save changes. Now we will going to test it. I will compose a test mail. You can see the signature here already. I will say blum, blum, blum. Then I will say blum, blum, blum. And I will send it to my other main email, parats.luka. Voila. Now I will come like to my main inbox. Okay, I got the mail finally. Okay, now I will check the inbox. I got the mail, Jonas test. And now let's say I receive this. Oh, I see LP Studio. What's this? And I click it, voila, you're in my page. So you got basically a clickable signature. The same you have like what I have for subscribe. If you feel, if you feel that this signature is like too big, as I said, go back to your inbox. You can always go back to settings, click the settings, go here select the signature and put it to be small you will not ruin anything just click save now try again let's compose again i personally feel it's a bit too small but like Whatever, it's up to you, basically, it's uh, about personal preferences and personal taste. So let's see it. Yeah, maybe for my monitor is a bit too small, but for mobiles it would be okay. But basically the most important thing is that it stands out. So yeah, that's it. If you like the video, please like it and please subscribe. Every subscriber means a lot. You were in another episode of Online Skills That Pay The Bills. Thank you, my LP Nation. As always, it was your guy, LP. Cause I'm not your